welcome back to Ooh. sorry about that hi guys welcome back to my channel god i know you guys are sad me now i'm super sorry <laughs> bro this country <laughs> i just really needed time to like chill out and you know understand what was going on because a lot was going on i'm just i'm just really overwhelmed and burnt out it's just time to get burnt out and i just needed a break these things are bound to happen right especially if you're someone who puts a lot of pressure on yourself i'm someone who i'm very hard on myself I'm, i feel like i don't even give myself grace at all i'm just super hard on myself so it's not a good thing you know because i'm trying to show for myself trying to be more kind with myself um i definitely feel like i've come a long way from where i was before in terms of trying to show more grace to myself you know um yeah so i'm just rambling but i just really wanted to apologize to you guys because um i said to myself this year i was going to be consistent and you know i'm kind of falling off again so I'm back now. Hopefully, you guys are still there to show me the support and the love. Back to you know giving guys content. I really want to share, you know, um, my journey because it might help someone out there, right? And that's what it's really about, you know, just you know helping people. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people are trying to come here and they're kind of like worried or scared. This is, this is the best decision for me. And how do I survive? It's gonna be hard. Let me be prepared, you know. So it's really about me just sharing my journey on how I'm just taking life, you know. And I also want to talk to you about, guys a little bit about how I'm also dealing with a lot of anxiety. Um, I used to have anxiety, but um, it's since I moved here, it's kind of like been up just because everything is just different. Everything is new to me and. I'm trying to keep up so of course my body is responding my mind is responding in that in the sense that it's getting anxious you know about what's happening so that can be really difficult to deal with um it's not easy but um i try my best to make sure i take control of the situation because the mind is also a very like very powerful tool if you use it in your favor i'm really excited to be back you know just with fresh pers perspective you know just with knowing or identifying what i need to do more or what i need to do to keep pushing myself so i'm happy to see where the next couple of months take us or the next couple of years i did not vlog i went out with my friends yesterday in fact i went out on friday and saturday and i did not vlog I didn't vlog that but if you follow me on instagram you probably have seen like clips of me going out it was really nice I went out with a couple of girls i met from monday girl then on saturday i went out to brunch with my friends um from nigeria it was really cool the restaurant was was good um i, I also inserted some clips here just so you guys can see um how that went as well um yeah so this is sunday and I just went out to do get my wax done and um very happy because it wasn't painful at all. I was expecting they would call an ambulance for me. It wasn't painful at all. Um of course it was painful but it wasn't you know. so going grocery shopping. I went to a Nigerian store yesterday. I got Indomie. <laughs> Indomie might be my best food actually. I, I don't want to like people side eye me when I say that. And it was just life. I think you guys are long. <laughs> So I'm back from the grocery store. I've unpacked, um, even meal prepped for the week. But I want to show you guys very briefly for my girls here who are probably dealing with dry skin i haven't tried these products right but i'm trying them because i've heard good things about them so i'm gonna give it a try and let you guys know 
how it does someone recommended this on tiktok that is really good for dry skin um it was a little bit expensive though this was like almost two, this was like 20 dollars i've heard really good things about johnson so i decided to buy it nivea nourishing intense moisture hydration intense 48 hours come on this is exactly what i need intensity because my skin is struggling and then i got this body polish for dry worn down skin so i'll let you guys know how it goes it's a beautiful place, you know, to have SUV, SOS, somebody rescued me, I've too many, I've too many of you. I had my colleague help me buy the pre-stretched hair. Okay. Yeah. Today is currently Saturday and I'm getting ready to go to my friend's place because um, I have to go and make my hair into braids and she's helping me with that. I'm gonna go there soon. I just need to deep condition my hair. I woke up this morning with so like very low energy. I was like, oh god, I'm trying to sleep in. Okay. Hi guys. So where did we leave off yesterday? I can't even remember where we left off yesterday, but I couldn't really vlog much because I was in a rush and I was taking public. Yeah, so I went and made my hair with my friend. Oh my gosh, guys, she did so well. It's exactly what I wanted. I really love this hair. Um, I'm going to leave her handle um, down in my channel. In case you're on GTA, you want to check her out. She did this and looks really nice on me um i'm feeling really accomplished today this morning i woke up i've cleaned my room um did, done my laundry um cooked i made ofada sauce i was craving nigerian food so i made ofada sauce i'm ready to do my makeup now because i'm going to the party i told you guys yesterday did i okay i'm going for a party later on today but before then i'm meeting up with a couple of girls first for pre drinks and then i'll go for the party is in downtown toronto i'm also filming and get ready with me for instagram if you don't follow me on instagram please follow my instagram page i to leave it down <laughs> chaotic this i know this vlog is chaotic i know uh, what happened yesterday loud afro lounge was good um dj was good for sure it was really packed there was no breathing space there wow nigerians like to party but yeah it was really packed came back really tired um so yeah sunday today is just a little like reset day for me so i usually do like cleaning attend church online as well groceries then you know just reset for the week tomorrow is a holiday i'm really excited about that but um i'll still try to get just plan for the week and you know get some personal work done watch me while i reset for the week so let me show you guys my thoughts <laughs>
to show you guys some new additions in my room like what some of the new stuff i got for my room um yeah let me show you guys so i got a new vase i bought this from amazon i really like it i think it gives my room like a vibe to be honest some of the things that i bought for this room i kind of regret because i feel like i wasn't intentional i know the direction or what i want for my room and this bed was a huge mistake because i feel like something else would have looked better for my vibe but it's okay and this is another one i think it looks really good this is another card i bought for walmart walmart or home sense i'm not sure maybe some books some books will look good there I bought a bulb for my lamp. I didn't I didn't buy a bulb previously, so it's so nice. Like I love I love it. Sometimes I don't put on my room like this is the light I put on and it just gives it a very nice touch to the room. Okay, so one of the things I got from um Amazon is this makeup stroke skincare acrylic organizer. Um, I think it does a pretty decent job. It wasn't really able to hold all of my stuff though, but it does a pretty decent job it helps me compartmentalize my skincare so another thing i also bought is this um tray and um this is the third vase i was telling you about from the amazon order and pampas squares of course i don't know if i like it i don't know if I, I i don't know i don't know i'm a bit iffy about it i don't know if i i like what i did here maybe a different color like this color for example would work i think it's the color and the size i think it's actually too big for that place i think that's the problem i don't know we'll see <laughs> housework um laundry cooking you know just cleaning and doing stuff um today i have planned out to do some personal work um i did have like a meeting with some mentor that i booked on monday girl i'm always talking about monday girl <laughs> yeah so i did um you know ask for feedback on a marketing portfolio i was working on and she gave me some pointers so i have to redesign my portfolio just a little tweaks here and there and um yeah but now i'm just getting ready to go to the gym by the way that i didn't even tell you guys i cancelled my gym subscription and, and, and my previous gym because my apartment has a gym now. They finally opened my apartment gym, so I don't have to spend money at a gym. So I'll show you guys what that looks like. Oh 